And we're back, guys. Welcome to Tennis in a Minute. I'm your host, Good Energy. We have the other quarterfinal of the day, Maria Zachary, the Greek goddess. Yes, I started that. I started that name, guys. It literally crawled, got legs, and ran wild all over the internet. Now it's a household name, the Greek goddess Maria Zachary, taking on Petra Kvitova, two-time, two-time Grand Slampion. Look, there's not many multiple Grand Slampions left, guys. Who do we have? We have Petra Kvitova. We have Victoria Azarenka, Simona Halep, who I haven't seen in a while. We have Angelique Kerber, Venus Williams. We have Iga Swiatek and Naomi Osaka. I mean, who else, guys? Can you think of anyone else? There's not many ladies left, guys. But nonetheless, this is the matchup here where, look, I've said it time and time again, Maria's got to step up. I feel out of all the top 10 players, she just underachieves the most. And I'm not trying to be disrespectful or hard on her, but she just doesn't come through when she needs to come through. Now, this is a routine forehand. She loves to hit that serve, you know, right midway down the line and then follow up with that strong forehand. She says her serves is her strongest shot. I think it's her forehand, but this is a routine shot. She comes up netting. Unbelievable. Another mistake here, routine shot, comes up netting. How do you come out in the biggest matches of your life, one of the biggest matches of your life, and you get broken to love? unbelievable guys but nonetheless what is it the conditions guys the conditions that day are nothing like the conditions at night uh the wind it's very very windy i players like ego who've played you know their matches at night have an advantage because in terms of practice sessions the practice sessions take place during the day so if you're playing during the day and then switching up at night you have to make adjustments because the wind here is very wild another routine winner for Zachary and she misses it now the announcer said uh a couple matches ago who was it was it Shelby Rogers or no I think it was Ann Helena they made an interesting comment about Zachary they said they're concerned because she was missing a lot of easy shots they're like you know I'm concerned for a top 10 player those are pretty routine shots I'm concerned but in her defense I will come to Zachary's defense and say look it's very very windy the conditions here mid-afternoon night are very very different from early morning matches here and let's take a look at wt 1000 events look petra is no stranger to experience guys she's played in several and maria she's lost more than maria's played in but nonetheless guys petra is a veteran but look how windy that flag is it's just blowing all over the place these conditions are brutal so a lot of those shots maria missed early on in her first service game it's due to the wind she's got to get adjusted to it petra's already adjusted she played last night against pegula but nonetheless guys if sacri's gonna win this in straight sets and prevent Petra from covering that spread. She's going to have to win 10 out of the next 12 service games. I doubt that's going to happen. So nonetheless, I'm your host, Good Energy Guys. Stay tuned for more tennis coverage. And Zachary got a 